so yeah hello guys welcome back to my channel so now today i came with a new custom widget uh, dynamo table so this custom widget will help you to create a custom table on your ssc reports or ssc uh, story okay currently we have by default table right in our ssc but suppose if you want to create some custom table with the custom records so how you will do to solve this problem <coughs> we came with new custom widget called dynamo table so this dynamo table will help you to create custom records on into your table and, uh, and one best thing is here you will get some uh, pagination as well like if you have too many records you will get paginations you will get search option and you will get some filter option and you can sh short as well you can short your uh, report as well here okay so let's get started so first of all you have to download this custom sheet okay so just click on this button it will download the custom sheet okay so it's downloaded let's key it back so let's come here so left panel go to your story go to your custom sheet and just select your file here so i'm selected the file okay it's added now let's get to story and let's create one report here so in this custom sheet we have only one function set uh, table data and it will take a parameter of array of the object okay so we have only single object okay so now let's add our custom sheet here set it so it's look like this okay now in the bindle panel you will see some uh, only one option to change the title suppose i'm giving demo table okay and press enter or click on this so it will update uh, this data now how to get record inside that so for that we have only one function so suppose let me create one button here okay or let me do one thing let me add code in the on installation okay so this on installation event will call when we open the application okay so i'm adding code inside that <clears throat> so what you have to do you have to use set uh, sorry first of all you have to give custom git name then set table data okay now it's taking record as array means it's taking data into selection format array of selection okay so we have to give data something like this let me create one variable here let me create array and set that i have to create object now here i will give some data okay suppose i want to give uh, employee details so suppose employee id 100 employee name was mine okay now one more data comma or let me copy the same go to here give 200 and suppose i'm giving another name okay so this is how you uh, we have to create a data okay so this this is the key and this is the way this uh, the custom jit will automatically identify this key as a column okay so now let me pass this uh, variable here and save it so i will say time table now let me click on view So it will take few minutes now see it's created one data okay and here we got two records you can search as well like if i'm doing low hit or if i'm doing 100 sorry yeah 100 or <coughs> 200 so it will filter out again you can short it just click on the column it will short data by the employee name or if you want to short with the employee id you can click on the employee id okay and here the entire page uh, uh thing like suppose in the in the one page how how much data you want to see so, so currently we have only two data so i have one simple data here so i'm taking this one and i'm saving it now let me come here and refresh now i think i have to increase the size of it let me come here and is the height now let me save and refresh 
not going to be 20 data now see let's thing uh, showing 10 data at a one uh, one page now we get the pagination as well now we can change get data with the pagination now here we have some option entire page option now if i click on the five it will give me only five record at a time and now you can see i will get pagination number if you want to see 10 just click on 10 if you want to see 15 you can just okay and if you want to get some filtering you can use filter as well right okay so this is how this dynamo uh, table is works okay so thank you so much for watching if you have any doubt you can feel free to contact me on my LinkedIn profile that uh, i have mentioned in my youtube description you will see in my skin as well so thank you so much have a good day